there is a kind of important issue going on uh, in our culture. Uh, on the one hand, between what is challenging, and I think that kind of most professions need to constantly challenge, challenge themselves, challenge their client, challenge the world. Uh, first is comfort, and it seems that kind of comfort these days is kind of vastly preferred over challenge. And so I've basically taken a few slides that kind of for me uh, illustrate this kind of enormous transition from one world to another. This is 1940. Uh, you see a man from behind. You see he's in a metropolis. Uh, and you can also see that the evening will be kind of full of adventure and that there may be uh, a lot of unpredictable things happening in the next uh, 24 hours. Here you see again a man from behind, uh, 50 years later. Uh, you see he's entering an environment where everything is predictable, everything is identical. There will not be uh, adventure or a very limited adventure. And in his back, he probably has a kind of uh, change of underwear. So what has happened? Yeah? Uh, why were we kind of open to adventure? And why are we now kind of more comfortable with uh, facing predictable futures? The same. Here, this is a kind of uh, picture of the transformation in Paris. We used to be, believe it or not, completely excited about this kind of transformation. We used to love this kind of transformation. And now what we do with our kind of spaces, we kind of make our spaces kind of very neat, very predictable, very safe. And in doing so, we also make them very exclusive because clearly this is not the environment where wild or crazy people would ever congregate. It's also true in art. This is Richard Serra in the 80s uh, with a kind of famous work of art that he put in the middle of a, a plaza uh, in a very inconvenient way for pedestrians that had to kind of walk around it. Uh, he was very challenging. And here we have another work, uh, work of Anish Kapoor only 30 years later. And it's so attractive. It's so nice that kind of people come to it in kind of great quantities. And I would say that we need this, uh, but we've forgotten we need it. Uh, I would also say we need this, but we've forgotten uh, we need it. And I would say we need this, uh, but we've forgotten we need it. <laughs>